The Marriott here in Florence already told me it's lost to some business because of the uncertainty with the football season. Now, their big money maker doesn't come from fans, but rather UNA's opposing teams because they stay here in this hotel, and all of that is up in the air. With home games, it does mean for the hotel, for the community, that we're going to lose that economic revenue that we would generally get. Selena Miller is Marriott of the Shoals Director of Sales and Marketing. She said in general the hotel industry has taken a hit. And locally, the possibility of losing the money that comes with UNA's football season is another blow. So while it, it definitely hurts the university, it also hurts the entire Shoals area. Monday, I spoke with head football coach Chris Willis. He said the football team makes money for the university. UNA was supposed to play Virginia Tech on September 26th. Tech canceled because of the pandemic. Now it's unclear if they will have to pay UNA the $425,000 they are going to get for the game. That's, that's going to turn into the school lawyers going through the paperwork. But no, I mean, just not having football in itself, we're, it's going to be a big financial hit around here. I mean, football kind of is the cash cow that runs everything that goes. And if you don't have a season, you're not bringing in any money. Willis told Way 31 today he hopes to play four non-conference games to help make up for financial losses. As for Miller, she said they're working with the university to offer those hotel packages for teams. We've been talking with UNA, working with them. You know, what do we need to do? How do we help each other? Um, I, I know UNA has been looking at, at other teams to come in and, and play. So we're just, however we can help the university and, and continue our partnership with them, that's what we want to do. Now, Willis told me earlier in the week that some of his players have concerns, too. Uh, if the school decides to play those four non-conference games, players could use up an entire year of eligibility just for those four games with no guarantee to play in the spring. The NCAA is supposed to make a ruling on that this Friday. UNA told me it will make a decision after that. Live in Florence, Breck and Terry, Way 31 News.